Well, hello, good afternoon to uh, one and all. Like you, we are very much ready to go here and looking forward to a game that has been the topic for universal conversation in this part of the world for much of the last few days. It's dry at the moment, but the forecasters have warned us of impending rain. There's no certainty about that, but uh, when it does come, it shouldn't affect the uh, dynamics of a match which has so much riding on it. It's a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game in stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. How are you reading this formation, Jim Begley? Well, the lone striker has to be prepared to do some of the work himself, but essentially he needs two of the three central midfielders to make runs beyond him and trust that the wide men can, can service the penalty box and make those link-up runs from out to in. He should get plenty of support with this setup. So it's away we go then. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? It's Casillas for me, because if he gets a little busy in this game, he has the talent and vast experience to cope with pretty much anything. He can be an extremely reassuring presence here. Just getting the best out of him will count for so much. Now it's a Bubakar. Plays it out to the wing. Now it's a Bubakar. Well read, he sorted that out. Oh, and he's got good distance. Who's chasing? can get it clear. Benzema did well to step in there. That was more than necessary. Isco. Dinks one in. Balls loose. Who's getting there? Danilo Pereira. Throw. Harvard Hell gets rid without sophistication. And that has been clubbed away. Just brushed off the ball there. Asensio has been caught there. It's a foul. immediate danger played out to the right great strength too strong for his opponent seems now to be all about width well when you have the personnel to create in wide areas then they need to see as much of the ball as possible as he picked him out, Pereira, out wide to the right. Courtois deals with it effortlessly. Marcel. Pretty robust, but it's got the job done. Oh, he's caught him there, it's a free kick. Benzema. Keeper goes long. Sergio Ramos gets into the right position to intercept. But it's Marco Asensio. Now it's Benzema. Keeper's got good distance on that. Herrera. Hoists it high. Looking for space out wide. Gorgeous control there. Drilled in low. Varane gets good distance on it. 
Porto have it back and they can go again. Alex Tellez goes for the cross, tries his luck. In once more. Ceballos knocks it away. Tries lifting it over. Bubakar clears it out of harm's way. That's not going to make it. Porto get it back again. Madrid still without an attempt on target. So who's he picking out? Nino Pereira, Alex Tellez, a reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. Plenty waiting in the middle, towering header! Oh, just needed a better contact. Madrid can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. Alex Tellez gets it back. And it's Abubakar. Abubakar! Vincent Abubakar quickly realised that he could have a pop, not his best. Can he score? Goal! Porto! And as soon as they made that error in midfield, they didn't have time to react before the ball hit the net. Very much a lesson learned. Porto break the deadlock and that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on Carvajal with a delicate ball and it's hoisted clear aimed long and direct Sergio Ramos does well to read it and intercepts. Madrid to retain the ball, but are seemingly in no rush to break forward. Asensio spreads it towards the left. Benzema could try cutting inside here. Pereira battles to win it back. Out to the left it goes. Marcelo going full steam ahead down the left flank. Benzema. And the shot! She wants to get it forward quickly. And it's Abubakar. Are proving themselves to be solid all over the field. Now it's a Bubakar. He's what looking to shoot. Great build up. It all deserved a better ending.
was he just trying to be a little too clever then? I mean, it's hard to say, but one thing's for sure. He needed to stick it away, and he knows it. Marco Asensio. Benzema plays it long. Cassius sends that a long way. Ceballos. And it's Benzema. Stuck out of leg for a good challenge. First 45 minutes are up. Well, there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Not the most convincing of displays. They could certainly do much better than this. They'll want to keep things simple, build up their confidence and not rush into mistakes. Second half gets underway. Madrid need to get the balance right to sort this out. Ambition must be complemented by just the right amount of caution, and I think the more experienced players can oversee that. Marino Pereira. Abubakar. Good challenge, he just stood firm. And it's Isco. Pepe cuts it out. Nino Pereira. Now it's a Bubakar. Yeah, he's fouled him there. And the referee has shown him a yellow card. Pepe. Abub it's a Bubakar! Gross boots it to safe, goes for goal! A great save, real class! Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. Alex Tellez does well there, alert, and out to safety. A really good feat. Herrera positions himself well and cuts it out. Herrera. Porto uh, keeping their men at arm's length here. I just think it's a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. It's come loose. Chip through. And that's been levered clear. Cruz gets it back. Caballos. Carvajal goes up and over. Madrid are able now to make their substitution. It's been on the cards for uh, a few moments now. This is promising. Timely intervention.
Madrid, still this single goal behind. Modric. It's Marcelo. Benzema. And this has gone, presumably, for offside. Oh, we're talking fractions. Well, the stats are pretty telling here. It's hard to argue with the scoreline when you carry so little threat. Caballos pushes it out wide. Benzema. Time to deliver. Chooses to go back. And oh! Cleared without complication. Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Madrid making consecutive changes here. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Just has to be done. Bios with a good steal, well played. Casemiro. Father Hal looking to run onto it. Who's ball? Who's going to get there? He ran himself into trouble there. Free kick given away. Alex Tellez. That'll be a throw in. Big chance. Marcelo with a fine tackle. Pereira. It's got through. Sergio Ramos can hoist it clear. Now it's Modric, going through. And it's Marcelo. Now it's Modric. Oh, that's nice. Modric goes for a sweeping cross. And he just whacks it away. Danger averted for now. Sergio Ramos hits it back. Tony Kroos. Foul, three kicks been given. <laughs> Brahimi, Danilo Pereira, done very well to intervene. Rafael Varane, forward it goes. Tony Kroos, Daniel Carvajal, Kroos. And the ball's come out! And he's there to hoof it away. And he heaves it forward. Madrid are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. Danilo Pereira. Now it's Abubakar. Over to the left. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage.
it's Carver Hal. Tony Cruz. He's looked long this time. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. All this over the line. to get it away it is now or never time is against them Bale well it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue the situation and it needs to be any time now really He's through and all alone! Fence has got rid of that. And it's been taken straight back. And Bemba. Plays it forward. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Tony Cruz. And it's Benzema. Bell! Saved only by poor finishing. Defender and it's hoisted clear. Bale Carvajal get that clear and time is up. Well, that is truly disappointing. It is a results business, and this result is worth nothing. That's a fairly demoralizing loss. They hardly threatened, and this was about as insipid as it comes. So that's it from us. Many thanks go to Jim Beglin and goodbye from us.
Well, good afternoon, everybody. It is uh, terrific to have you along for our live coverage of this uh, eagerly awaited contest. It should provide some terrific entertainment on uh, what is turning into a rather imperfect afternoon. The weathermen really get it wrong, and uh, they have warned us that there is rain on its way. Shouldn't be bad enough in any sense meaningfully to impact on the game of football, but it is a factor to be taken into consideration. Plenty of other factors, of course, principally each side's concern for the strengths of the other. Certainly this is a very, very impressive venue, quite a sight to behold. The lineup we have suggests it's going to be a 4-5-1 formation, Jim. Well, most teams that use this system, Peter, will work it in a, a way where, yes, they'll have a 4-5-1 shape off the ball and ideally a 4-3-3 shape on it. We often see that 4-1-4-1 shape too, and that has an obvious flexibility about it. It's a, it's a popular managerial selection because of that. It's just extremely flexible with all the numbers I've mentioned. There's the whistle. Bruma. Oh, good interception. Stop Dooney. Tries to get it forward quickly. And it's got through. Going for goal! He's done very well to get to that. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes work ultra-sharp. Calderim. And it's Mbolo. Mbolo. He's being closely tested here. Oh, super tackle. They were outnumbered and under the cosh. That had to be spot on, and it was. Lovely feet. Tries to dink it in. And that's been levered clear. Short, over it comes. Danger averted for now. Plays it out to the wing. Mustasic. Hoists it high. Looking for space out wide. Embolo. Oh, he's got a crucial block in there. Soldado. Soldado. Kolopienka battles to win it back. Bolo. Mustasic. Anything, Jim, to pick out of these early exchanges? Stompuli goes looking. Played out to the right. Cut out in the nick of time. Skirtle gets rid without sophistication. Aslan. And it's Mbolo. Topal with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. The referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket. It's just a stern lecture. It's on a plate. And it's Mbolo. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Up for a throw. And 
and it's Mbolo. He's got away, fires it in low. And he heaves it forward. And it's been taken straight back. Soldado. Soldado. Benabache so far providing no real test at all. That's a pop! Again, let me mention what a wonderful stop the goalkeeper pulled off there. Really wonderful. Caligiuri. Bentaland. Empolo. Goalkeeper's ball. Soldado. Lovely bit of skill. It's a very good battle there. Terrific to watch. Out to the left it goes. That's a throw. And it's Konoplyanka. Soldado. Here it comes. Oh, that's neat. So who's he picking out? Matija Nastasic gets good distance on it. And it's Mbolo. Konoplyanka. Mbolo. Aslan, Soldado, over to the left. Balls loose, who's getting there? Konopienka. If anyone is going to break the deadlock, now would be a good time. Konopienka. Bentaleb. Caligiuri. Oh, that is lovely footwork. And it's Mbolo. Arslan. Soldado. Bentaleb. Calicuri. That's gone a long way up and away. Calicuri. Looks to thread it through. Has a look and plays it in. And that has been clubbed away. Managed to get it away. Schalke put it back again. Plays it out to the flank. Played into space out wide. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. The half time whistle goes. So neither team has broken through. But certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. An engrossing half. But we're still where we started, nil-nil.
Here we go again, then. So, deadlock still as the second half begins. Konopienka. Did really well to intervene and dispel the growing danger. Moses. Topper. And it's Falcuena. And helps available out wide. Cleared without complication. Did well to step in there. That was more than necessary. Konopienka. Acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Ah, oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. Topal. Moses. It'll be a throw in. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Konoplyanka. Yeah, that's top defending in preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Now it's Ayu. He'll have a dip! Oh, great save, real class. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. It's Caligiuri. Topal with a good steal, well played. More than happy to take the muscular approach. A real chance to break. All the way back and they start again. Well, they see lots of the ball. Trying to go for it a bit, a bit of creativity and adventure. Aimed long and direct. Valbuena, he's left his man. Chills one in. Forward it goes. It's a loose ball. Good challenge, he just stood firm. And it's on the back foot. And it's Mbolo. Pushes it out wide. Tried to play it through. Yeah, the idea was right. The delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. Aziz. Calderim. Very few chances to talk of, Jim. Defence is, it seems, on top here. Yeah, I think it's a scoreline in keeping with what we've seen up to this point. Combined it. Shot a goal! And it's hoisted clear. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Sit into the towering header! And he just shoots! It's been taken short. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Oh, and he's got good distance. Who's chasing? Shots on. And he's there to hoof it away. Usbarakli. Out wide to the right. Now the counter. Konoplyanka. And it's got through. Oh, that's a waste.
Valbuena. Walks out on the left now. He's through. Now it's Ayu. Ayu. Valbuena delivers. Matija Nastasic knocks it away. And now they can launch a counter. Decent looking ball. He's made sure that that won't get through. Schalke showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Uh, that's a foul. Referee's given it. Goes for it. And he's there to make a great save. Well, what can I say? A truly wonderful goal. goal. This was the obvious substitution. He become just a little jaded, and as a result of that, he was most likely to make a mistake. I think sometimes when the body becomes tired, the brain goes with it, and I think that's happened in this case. Not offside that time. Yeah, he was off ever so slightly, but he was off. It's Ayu. Giacchi looks to clip it forward. Neatly flicked on. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. He's brushed off the ball there. Fenerbahce merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. Here it comes. Can he put it away? Well, he should have done better, and he knows it. Andre Ayew did give it a fair old crack, and he'll be encouraged to step up again. Ball's got out of play, and a change is upcoming. Pushes it out wide. Just five minutes remaining now. Bentelet. And it's Bergstahl. Bentelet. Big chance! Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Moses. Looking for space out wide. Moses. Moses. Here's the chance to cross. Lings in across. Stop Dooney. Boots it to safety. And that will be the final act. Well, it looked nil-nil from a fair way out. Little craft or guile or penetration. Defences largely untroubled. It's goals. How would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Fenerbahce certainly had some good moments, Peter. There were plenty of encouraging spells that more should have been made of. Well, thanks for your company, Jim, and a very good day to you.
Well, whatever time of day or night it is with you, welcome along to a game which is threatened, I have to tell you, by a rather forbidding weather forecast. The expectation is for quite heavy rain as the game grows older this evening. It hasn't arrived just yet, but it will do shortly. Glad to report, though, that that hasn't affected the crowd, who are here in good number and indeed in good voice. And the game will be underway very soon. We have terrific scenes in front of us at the Estadio do Regal, one of the biggest venues in Portugal. Crystal Palace have gone with a 4-5-1 gym. Well, this setup, Peter, can be very defensive if that midfield is in place purely to form a protective layer in front of the back four. But it can also be the launch pad to very quick counter-attacks if you can offer pace and accuracy on the front foot. It can have a, a devastating effect, actually, uh, at the offensive end of the pitch, too. So, off we go, then. He's left his man. Can he score? There it is! An extraordinary start. Breakthrough in next to no time. I think he just thought about trying his look from further out there, but why bother when you can worm your way through a defence like that? It's it's terrific play to, to get through and score. Wolfsburg take the early advantage. Forward it goes. Joel Ward. Mamadou Sacco plays it forward. A really good feat. Dashing forward at pace. And it's got through. Leave it clear. Piate, Townsend. Back to the keeper and try something new. Piate. Milivojevic. Aimed long and direct. Locked. Tries to get it forward quickly. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Camacho. He just whacks it away. And it's hoisted clear. And he's made sure that that won't get through. to play it through. Uh, it was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. Ball's loose, who's getting there? He's got away. Oh, that's neat. Uh, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Benteke, chance to break. 
Aimed long and direct. Looking for space out wide. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. And that's a throw. That baby. Going through. Mamadou Sako. Milivojevic. Joel Ward. Townsend. Boots to safety. Maya. Well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Left lady. And the finish! He scores! Two up and threatening to pull clear. Well, no goalkeeper would keep that out. It really was a bullet. That is just the top draw finish. He was always in control and couldn't have placed it any better. Wolfsburg have a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Gets good distance on it. Joel Ward goes up and over. It away, shoots. And that's caused a worry or two. Uh, that's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. Piatti, MacArthur pushes it out wide. Lovely bit of skill. He's got away. And he heaves it forward. And he has been fouled there. What's he given? Well, the referee has given a free kick just outside the box. Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score. And obviously, he's not going to allow that, Peter, is he? He's gone for the shots. That is gorgeous. Sumptuous finish, an absolute joy. And they are cruising away. And he's produced a beauty.
Wolfsburg take a three-goal lead and they are romping out of sight. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. Aimed long and direct. Oh, nice touch. Going out for a throw in. Clearance and very necessary. And that's sprayed out wide. Done very well to intervene. Forward it goes. Oh, good interception. Nice to get it forward quickly. Meyer. Aimed long and direct. Benteke. It's a loose ball. Danger averted for now. Crystal Palace have it back and they can go again. And it's Townsend. MacArthur kicks it out wide. Going for goal! That is wayward. Oh, I'm not sure what he had in mind, and I don't think he knew either. Baby. That's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Kuyate. Milivojevic goes looking. Lobs it in gently. Ball is over the line. Tries to dink it in. MacArthur crosses it in. Benteke. Camacho. Ball. Who's going to get that? In towards the middle. Schlupp boots it to safety. And the referee brings the first half to a close. As easy as one, two, three. It really has been that straightforward halfway through the match, but very little to suggest that much will change over the second half. Second half. Crystal Palace changed their lineup for the second half. A reaction, no doubt, to the half time score. And it's Ward. Andros Townsend gets into a good position. Great leap! Keeper's got his work done. Beth Mady. Camacho. Forward it goes. Wolfsburg have really been terrific at snuffing out the threat. Now for something different. Maya. Mamadou Sako. Fiate. MacArthur. Tries to stroke it through. Here it comes. Townsend. 
Nicely measured pass. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Camacho. Beth Mady. Can he finish? And it's there! Surely now they are well and truly out of sight. Oh, my goodness, that has ripped the rigging. Is it just me, or did he make that look very, very easy? That was terrific skill and composure from him. He finished with such a plumb. Wolfsburg totally rampant here. The car. Joel Ward plays it forward. And that's been levered clear. And it's McCarthy. Has it out wide now. Time to deliver. Towering header. Decent chance. That is a fine delivery. Do I really need to tell you, Peter, that he has to do better, especially from there? MacArthur. Benteke. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. He's gone down, but the referee just tells him to get back up again. He's picked him out. He's left his man. He's making good use of his strength there. Just refuses to be out-muscled. Well played, he saw that coming. Dicks one in. Now it's Benteke. Battles to win it back. Andros Townsend has it out wide and it's... Can he finish? Has faded wide. Well, that's why we all say indecision is fatal. Forward it goes. Now it's Benteke. Townsend. And he just whacks it away. Get that clear. Crystal Palace have a free kick. Hoisted clear. Sacco gets it back. MacArthur floats one over. Joel Ward goes for the cross, shapes the shoots. Oh, he really got hold of that.
Sacco tries a pass forward, but it's Maya. Benteke. Out to the flank, Camacho, Crystal Palace still contemplating when to use their last remaining substitute. Milivojevic, and they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Chance. Townsend. Benteke. Joel Ward. Townsend. Townsend. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Drilled in low. Zaha. Looks to clip it forward. Cleared without complication. They're playing a guessing game, Peter, without any answers, and the lack of quality is just there for everyone to see. Now he's wondering who wants it. Good idea, just poorly executed. And it's Benteke. With a delicate ball, looking for space out wide. Piate, hoist it clear. Wolfsburg get it back again. In again, header! Keeper always had the measure of that. Benteke. The final five minutes. Townsend. Goops it to safety. Crystal Palace have been made to look one-dimensional. Lots of penalty box activity, but rarely any quality. Plays it out to the wing. Both sides then taking this chance to turn to their benches. I think you have to admire his willingness to keep plugging away, but the manager has, has done him a big favour, I think, by, by taking him off. You know, he was looking very, very leggy. It into the middle. Kiyate knocks it away. And he's there to hoof it away. Goes down, but nothing given. Zaha. And the referee brings it to a close. Well, that is truly disappointing. It is a results business, and this result is worth nothing. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Jim? Well, look, it was very, very side I think their players didn't turn up for the first half, uh, and, and then it all went downhill. downhill. Thanks, Jim, Jim. And with that, it is a very good night to you.
Well, hello and welcome to what amounts to football heaven. It doesn't get a whole lot better than this. The conditions are utopian. The sky is blue and the players are with us for a football match so widely and keenly anticipated. Truly, this is pristine and the uh, level of expectation and excitement is reflected in the smiling faces of the crowd. They know it means so much and they also experience between them a great sense of privilege at uh, being able to attend this most special of games. This must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. And that gets things running. Diego Tardelli. What an adventurous run from a defender. Keeps everyone guessing. He goes long. Diego Tardelli. Well, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Madison and it's all bright Mondi did well to step in there that was more than necessary he's found his man oh it's opened up nicely for him looking for a decent ball in a chance Drawn. Uh, given such an open invitation, he was always going to shoot. Well, he made it obvious as to where the pass should be played, Peter, and it made the finish look that bit easier. Premio take the early advantage. Maguire plays it forward. All the way back and they start again. Well positioned to make that interception. Now the counter. Uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Uh, was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. Oh, real chance! And he's there to hoof it away. Tielemans takes it out wide. One over. Premio making the ideal start. It is something to build on. Always when you score early, it gives you such a lift and it, it casts doubt in the minds of your opponents at the same time. And that pretty much sums up the He's had a shot!
Gremio oh, very much in charge here, dominating possession and a goal to the good. He's a clever pass. And that's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. it out. Leicester seem happy to let their strikers roam out wide. I wouldn't want that. No? Yeah, well, my worry is that their, their main threat is being shifted out of contention. It'll be a throw-in. Nice touch. Here it comes. Just deflected behind for a corner. Oh, smart save. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Well, you might think he got off lightly. It is just a verbal warning. out of harm's way. And that has been clubbed away. He's in space and looking for options. Maguire gets rid without sophistication. chance to break he's picked him out he's got away all Brighton pumps it into the area knocks it away tries to get it forward quickly Diego Tortelli Tielemans, Vardy, swung over, great leap! He's done well to get his head on that, but couldn't score. Romeo can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. Loose ball, in comes the cross, and that's been levered clear. Gremio have it back and they can go again. And it's hoisted clear. Fires it in low. Maguire can hoist it clear. Tielemans, Premio scored early, of course, and it's 1 0. Morgan Back to the keeper and go again. Maguire, well, the score's only 1 0, but that doesn't tell the full story. Now it's Vardy, done very well to intervene. Forward it goes. Montoya. Premio are ahead here. It has been a good half for them. Plays it out to the wing. Out for a throw.
Madison. Tielemans. Mondi. Madison. Now it's Vardy. And it's Albright. Albrighton looking to get on the end of this. Gets up to head it! Forward pass. Diego Tortelli. Montoya. And helps available out wide. Receives it from behind. Good take by the keeper, he's read that well. There's the half-time whistle. So there you have it, a close sport half of football. But well, it still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. Well, that certainly pleased the fans, and the players are definitely happy with that scoreline. The question is now, can they protect it? Premio come off having scored the only goal of the game so far. It's been tight, it's been exciting, and there is certainly plenty for us to chew on during the break. Underway again. Gremio going well here, and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit, but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. Picks one in. Oh, it's Diego Tartelli. Diego Tartelli. Not played the ball, that's a foul. <laughs> Keeper goes long. Mondi. Aimed long and direct. Chilwell. Gazelle. Looks to dink one in. Vardy. And the finish! Big relief. It just needed better contact. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance. One straight back. Maguire. Mondi. Chilwell. And a foul. Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Get it away. Diego Totelli. He's played him through. Going through. He'll have a dip. Great build up. It all deserved a better ending. It didn't quite come off on this occasion, but it only needs a gentle tweak. Tries to dink it in, looking for space out wide. Montoya. Diego Tardelli. Leicester have anticipated uh, an aerial bombardment. It just looks like mass defence. 
Yeah, it's a case of needs must at certain times, Peter, and, and they have to respond to what's being asked of them. That is as far as they're going to go. And he heaves it forward. We sit high, gets into some space. Stuck out a leg for a good challenge. Danger averted for now. Looks to clip it forward. Chills one in. Tielemans pushes it out wide. Looks to thread it through. Madison! A oh, well played. He's taken that really cleanly. Gasell. Leicester are definitely going about this the right way. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. It upfield. Lobs it in gently. And he just whacks it away. Tried to play it through. Yeah, the idea was right. The delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. Tielemans looking to run onto it. Montoya. Jim, what are you thinking? Well, it's a natural instinct to defend when ahead, but it's too early for them to settle into that practice just now. Gasol. And it's Chilwell. Now it's Vardy. Good clearance and very necessary. Maguire gets it back. Try cutting inside here, and he's whipped it in low. It's gone a long way up and away. It's wrestled off the ball. Morgan goes looking. Or Brighton goes up and over. The referee has given a corner. Brighton with the short one. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Still going. Where to next? There are a few waiting for it. And it's Chilwell. That is stunning, just too hot to handle. That is just the top drawer finish. He was always in control and couldn't have placed it any better. Here's a change that was in the offing. Last one allowed. Leicester grab the equaliser and we're all square. Leicester surely know by now that they've put so much work into producing the equaliser that they'll battle on for a winner. You know, it's, it's all one-way traffic for them now and they simply have to capitalise on it. Gray with a delicate ball. He's hit one! Back of the net! They've done it! It was coming! They have their reward! And however many surrounded him, that is what he can do.
Oh, this fella's as slippery as a eel the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defence, it was a case of now you've got him, now you don't. Brilliant. Leicester take the lead. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Going through, and he's onside. Over to the left. And it's been given away. Turns and goes back. Out to the left it goes. And it's got through, and he has been fouled there. Well, some of them are letting their emotions get the better of them. They don't want to inflame this any further. and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Now it's Vardy. Mondi. Fermio are in a tearing hurry to save themselves here. They need something heroic now, or a lucky break or a kind refereeing decision. Anything. Maguire, Morgan, Gray, Vardy. Goes long. Here it comes. Boots it to safety. He certainly caught him there. It's a free kick. Well, that looks like a final warning, still no card. Goes. Gazelle. This official showing that there will be three minutes of added time. And sprayed out wide. He's got it and he's got time. Whistle's gone and they've got themselves a free kick. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket. It's just a stern lecture. He's having a go. In for the follow up. Same again, same outcome. This is proving to be a very good spell. The intensity is great, but uh, they've got to make it count. He 
slid it through. Can he shoot? And his time is up, and there goes the whistle. Premio have fallen short on the day. They're going to need to bounce back from this. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Well, they were posed with problems in wide areas, and they couldn't find the solution to those wide defensive positions. Shocking, really. I think we're just about out of time, so many thanks to Jim, and a very good afternoon to you.